Microtol has been providing sterilization services to the healthcare industry since 1983. Sterilization is a process that frees a product of bacteria, viruses, and other forms of microbial contamination. Globally, the popular methods for terminal sterilization today are ethyl oxide sterilization and gamma radiation sterilization. The gamma radiation process is carried out in an irradiator where products are exposed to electromagnetic energy from a cobalt-60 source in a controlled manner. The products to be irradiated are loaded into tote boxes which are placed on the product frame. The product frame then moves into the irradiator. The product frame has four parts, two each on either side of the cobalt source. The gamma rays emitting radioactive cobalt source rises from the 6 meter deep water shield which otherwise safely captures the gamma rays. The product is then conveyed around the cobalt source in a preset order such that all product boxes receive the desired energy equally. After desired exposure, the cobalt 60 source is lowered into its water shield and the door opens to complete the cycle. The entire cycle is operated through a PLC at the end of which the absorbed dose is measured by a process called dosimetry. The second process we deploy is the ethyl oxide or ETO sterilization process. In this case, the product is loaded into steel sterilizers and remains stationary. Inert gases are injected to remove all traces of air. The product load then undergoes the conditioning phase during which the product is humidified and its temperature raised to desired levels. A pre-validated quantity of the sterilant, that is, ETO gas, is then injected into the sterilizer and the product is exposed to a predetermined period of time. At the end of the cycle, degassing of ETO takes place and aeration is carried out to remove all traces of the ETO gas. The spent ETO gas is disposed into an abatement system or scrubber which neutralizes the gas which is then sent to an ETP, that is, a fluent treatment plant for disposal. Process Validation Regulations stipulate that both sterilization processes are validated to ensure they repeatedly achieve sterility assurance levels. The most popular procedure for validating the ETO sterilization process is the half-cycle validation process using biological indicators as process challenge devices. In the case of gamma, the desired sterilization dose for the product is first established after which dose mapping confirms the dose distribution in the product. Microtol formulates gas mixtures for its captive use and also supplies mixtures to domestic and international customers. Microtol also offers bio-burden reduction services that help eradicate pathogens like E. coli, salmonella, etc. Steam pasteurization services is the latest offering from Microtol.